Howdy ho, Junior Rangers. Holy crap. Time is flying. We are going to be reviewing week 10 today of my fat loss phase. Meaning that I only have two more episodes of the fat loss portion of the series. And then we're going to tumble into a new series, which is going to be my reverse dieting series. Um, but yeah, this is episode nine. Let's jump right in to what happened this week. So my targets for my fat loss have been very much the same for the past, like, what, three to four weeks. And it's to strength train four times a week, to hit 8,000, 7,000 steps per day, I think. But I've been honestly closer to, like, eight to 10,000 steps for a majority of this. Um, 1,750 to 1,850 calories per day and I've really been sticking closer to the 1750 side and then finally 120 to 130 grams of protein whoa and let's talk about how this week went of course starting with my progress pictures what everybody wants to see and I'm going to be honest I was comparing my progress pictures and I'm having like a hard time seeing a difference I think my legs look bigger I think my biceps and my shoulders look bigger. And I do look leaner in the waist. I get really snatched when I lose weight, I've noticed. But because of like the lighting being weird, part of me is like, did anything change? Or do I look exactly the same? From the side, I know things have changed. My arm looks a little leaner. But I don't know why I'm like psyching myself out. The physical differences don't look crazy to me. Except I think my waist really is snatching. So I don't know. My journey hasn't been very like dramatic, but I'm down 10 whole pounds. I am down 10 whole pounds. So I started the week really high. Y'all saw with one for weighing in at 144 because I had an indulgent weekend. But then come Thursday, I had a new low weigh in of 140.6. My previous low was 141.4. And then my weight just kept going down. 140.4. Then my lowest low so far is 140 flat. 140.4. 140.6. And then this morning I was 141.4. Which I'm not mad about because I literally did not poop on Monday. <laughs> For some reason I did not poop on Monday. And I think that really impacted my weigh-in. As well as on Monday, I had dinner really late. I had dinner at like 8, 9 p.m. So I think it makes sense that my weight is a little bit higher. Not only that, but my period is in six days. So I'm most likely holding on to a little bit more water because of my period. Not only that, but I trained so hard on Monday that I got a crick in my neck. I was literally like this, walking around like this. That's how bad the crick in my neck was. And then I woke up this morning. I didn't have as bad of a crick, but then my whole neck, my trap, my upper back, everything was sore from just holding that tense position. <laughs> so I took two painkillers this morning and I've been groggy all day, like just not the best situation. I did not go to the gym today, Tuesday, but I did hit my workouts perfectly last week. And dude, I've been slaying at the gym. I really feel like I've been able to maintain my strength through this cut, which is really fun. So as you can see, I've been feeling a little bit more bloated, a little bit more gassy. I wonder if that has to do with the fact that I'm eating a shit ton of beans. <laughs> that could be one thing for sure. But then also maybe like my digestion just isn't as optimal because I've been dieting for a good period of time. I feel like this week and the last week, I've really been starting to feel the effects of dieting. Like I've been starting to feel more groggy, brain fog, hangry. I've been feeling hangry and like low patience lately. Um, today I was feeling super groggy because I took pain medication. But I can kind of like feel myself feeling more tired. You know what I mean? I, I've just been really feeling it this week. It's probably also in combination with my PMS because I'm PMSing. Um, but... Week 10 was a beautiful week. I'm still dropping weight. So I I saw new lows week 8, week 9, and week 10. 
which is fun. And now all we have is week 11 and week 12 left. Holy crap. Holy crap. But you can see my fat loss trend. Really fun. Is that everything? Oh, yeah. As you can see, my steps were in a great place. Like I said, my calories are in a great place. I've been hanging out in the 1700 Club. Um, my protein has been in a good place. Now, as far as morale, like I said, I'm definitely feeling hungrier. I've noticed that I've had a lot more thoughts about food. I'm really looking forward to my meals. Like I'm, I'm thinking about food a lot more. And this week, week 11, morale isn't low per se, but I'm definitely hungry. I definitely want food and I could definitely eat everything. I've also been noticing that I've been eating more quickly, like scarfing my food down because I'm so hungry. In fact, I'm hungry right now and I could really eat something right now. Um, but that's really it. Nothing crazy. Uh, things are chugging right along. This morning, even though I weighed in a little bit heavier, I actually was feeling leaner. So I was feeling really good in my body despite weighing in heavier. We'll see if this week we get a new low. Honestly, I don't think I want to change anything this week. I thought I would want to change stuff, but I don't think I do. I think I want to stay at 1750 and see if my weight doesn't budge. If my weight doesn't budge, then I'll go ahead and drop to 1650 for week 12. It'll be literally one week at 1650. Like I'll be fine. Um, but this week I'm just going to leave things where they are. Just, I just want to leave things where they are. So that's kind of my update for this week. Kind of a, a quick video. Things are moving in the right direction. We're feeling leaner. We're still strong in the gym. Morale is, it's lowering, but I think I'm, I'm excited to finish strong in the, in the fact that there's only like basically a week and a half left now. I can do it. I can do it. So keeping everything the same, four sessions a week, eight to 10,000 10, steps per day, 1750 calories, really going to stay in that 17. 100, 1750 range, and 120, 130 grams of protein. Quick one this week, wasn't it? Not much to report. It's been smooth sailing. It's been chill. Just know that I'm hungry. Mama's hungry. And I'm excited for that reverse. In fact, it's all that I think about. I cannot wait to, raise, to bring my food back up. Very boring update. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up so that I know that you're interested in it. Subscribe if you're into that. Share it with a friend that you think might benefit from this information, which I know you have somebody who will. And don't forget to ding, 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 ding. Click that little notification bell so you never miss another video from me ever again, 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 again. Okay. Bye.